So, Toddy, you mentioned this man earlier, so I'm going to swing it to you first. Fact or cap, Jalen Brown will win NBA Finals MVP this year. I mean, it's possible. I feel like um, – Jalen- Fact or cap, not it's possible. Jason Tatum is currently favored to the uh, Finals MVP. Jason Tatum, yes, the guy that didn't score the ball well in the first two games. Um, I'll say this is a cap. I think JT could still find a way to win it um, just because it's all around play. I get the first two games, he had to score the ball well. Um, it could I'm be having your triple double, it could be. I really don't care who wins, but um, I'm a gambling man, and Vegas is telling me that uh, Jason Tatum is still probably going to win it somehow, some way. But if Jalen Brown wins, I'm all for it. Hell, he won uh, the, the Larry Bird Award and then he wins finals MVP. He's got a He's got a nice trophy case, and then he wins the NBA championship. So um, I'm going to say Kappa right now just because I think JT um, can still definitely win it based off his play in the first two games of what he's uh, projected to do in games three and four. So I'll say it's Kappa. I think that Jalen Brown won't win it. But if he does, I'm I'm in the background celebrating with him. <laughs> so I'm in the locker room popping champagne with my, with my snow goggles. I'm doing it all. So. I'm not opposed to this happening, but I'll say this is Cap. All right, Gay, I'm going to swing it to you next. Fact or Cap? Dylan Brown will win NBA Finals MVP this year. Obviously, technically, it should be Cap because I still got the Mavs and the Celtics winning. No, the Mavs and Luka winning. But just, I guess, we'll just fall into this trap real quick for you, Kev. I'm going to say Fact. Uh, Dylan Brown is going to win NBA Finals MVP because – and if he just if he just plays the same yeah. way the whole way, um, he should get it because then it'll be like that basically like that year like KD and uh Curry were kind of fighting for it, and then I think Curry had like one bad game, and so then they gave KD. So even if you know Tatum ends up you know doing great rest of the way, if Jalen Brown does great rest of the way, obviously the tip of the cap probably gonna have to go to Jalen Brown, and so but. Hey man, I'm not gonna lie, their team can anyone can win it. I can see Holiday winning. I can see even Porzingis winning if he comes back next two games. You never know. Derek White can man probably win it too. I don't know. Their team, like we mentioned earlier, has a lot of great pieces. So I think this is. But I'm gonna go with fact of who I would probably bet on so far after two games. If the Celtics win the championship, I'd put my money on Jalen Brown winning the NBA Finals MVP. But too bad it ain't happening. All right, Sean, I'm gonna swing it to you next. Factor cap. Jalen Brown will win NBA Finals MVP this year. This is a fact, and the reason why isn't just because of Jalen Brown's scoring so far. Is yeah, he's had 22 and he's had 21, and that doesn't look very impressive. But it's obviously been in wins. But the important thing to me is the efficiency, because if you look at last night, he goes eight of 15 from the field to score those 21 points. He also had seven assists and four rebounds. No big deal. Obviously, Drew Holiday was the star of Sunday night's show. You look at game one, Jalen Brown scored 22 points on 7 of 12 from the field, six rebounds, two assists. And so the overall point is that his efficiency is there. He's averaging some of the highest points on the team, if not the highest, because Jason Tatum is obviously not there right now. And I don't think that we can count on Drew Holiday to score 26 points over the next two, three, however many games is left. And so if slash when the Celtics win the NBA championship, like Toddy and I predicted, no matter in how many games, then I think that they ultimately give it to not only the highest scorer, but the most efficient. And through two games, that is Jalen Brown. And so I say this is a fact. Jalen Brown will win NBA Finals MVP this year, and that will have a hit to Jason Tatum's legacy. I'm happy you teed that up for me. Fact or cap, Jalen Brown won NBA Finals MVP this year. This is a fact. Everyone has you guys are all saying the Celtics are going to win the championship. That's Everyone the has mentioned why he deserves it. Let's look at the other side of the spectrum. If Jason Tatum does not win Finals MVP, he becomes – he gets to go on the Robin list. Let me tell you who's on the Robin list. We have guys like Clay Thompson, Scottie Pippen, Kyrie Irving, David Robinson, Robert Parrish, Paul Gasol, David Robinson's not a Tony Parker, one. Kevin McHale. One. All these guys are all-star caliber players that got group A, got A's on the group project. They don't walk away with the trophy. 
They walk away with all the personal accolades, but at the end of the day, they are not the best player on the championship team. And that shows because Scotty got to do it six times. So if Jason Tatum, like Toddy's mentioned, you know, he's first team all NBA, so he deserve he's gonna get all the credit, he's gonna get all the, the banter. He's first team all NBA, and I we I question it to the panel. There's no other first team all NBA player in the playoffs that had eight points and their teams up by 15 at halftime. So it just goes to show that is Jason Tatum the best can Jason Tatum be the best player on a championship team? Because we saw it in 2022 when he couldn't be. So they bring in Porzingis and Drew, and now he's the third, fourth fiddle. You know, all first team all NBA. He's gonna be the highest paid player in NBA history next season. This is supposed to be the year of Jason Tatum going on and getting an Olympic medal, signing the large, uh, the, the world's largest extension. And now people are looking around like, are you going to pay 400 mil for, for Robin? You know, Robin doesn't get a bat symbol. There's not a Robin symbol in there. It's just the Batman symbol. So will Jalen Brown win finals MVP? I'm going to say this is a fact. So, One of the guys you mentioned on your list was David Robinson. I'm going to disagree with you. David Robinson won an NBA MVP in 95, so I don't think he's a, that qualifies him as a Robin. Um, Tony, but, let me ask you a question. How many did he win? One MVP. No, how many final I mean, NBA championships did he win? Won one. Or three. Won three. One, three. So, I mean, a squirrel, can, a blind squirrel can catch a nut, right? Okay. But <laughs> I'm just saying, you know, you get on this list of guys <laughs> that are just, you know, along for the ride and – you know, he's complaining that we the people call us super team. We didn't get coach of the year. We didn't get MVP. When he said we didn't get MVP, that nigga wasn't thinking about Jalen Brown. He was thinking about him. <laughs> I'm just hey, saying. Uh, Celtics are going to win a championship is what you're saying. Toddy, it's okay to defer and deflect, but you have about a week and a half before this is everything that people are talking about. So we're just trying to prepare you because if, if Jalen Brown wins finals MVP – that's all people are talking about is if Jalen Brown is the best player on the Celtics. They got to call him champion. That That's exactly what I was about to ask Jay Vaughn is it's like, okay, yeah, we get to deal with this narrative. Vaughn, but at the, at the end of the day, the Celtics would be champions for that narrative. Well, we call champions champion too, Toddy? Robert Horry? Is that what Jason Tatum's going to go down as? Oh, come on. No, I'm just Kevin. saying, there's plenty of people Kevin. on the ring. Second half of John. Plenty of uh, people Kevin on the ring. Now Jason Tatum is Robert Horry. I'm just Robert, saying, there's, there's plenty of people with rings that get to sit back and say I have championships, but everyone doesn't get to take home the finals MVP trophy. Kevin, if, of Let me four, ask you this, Toddy. If there was ever a, sim- a series where LeBron James didn't win finals MVP, is there, <laughs> is there not an uproar? Is there not an uproar? If my if Scottie Pippen would have won one of them final MVP, is it not an uproar? Niggas are losing their mind because the Scottie narrative Pippen led them to the playoffs when Michael Jordan wasn't on the team. Oh, that's cute. Did he win a, Did he get a trophy for that? I don't think so. If you can do it and you get to the big dance and you're the narrative is you're the best player. This is your team, and when the lights get the brightest. Jalen Brown is coming to take the show. Not only did he win the Larry Bird trophy, he's going to win the final MVP trophy. And then what do people say about Jason Tatum? Should Jalen Brown have gotten the USA spot? No. <laughs> I, I mean, why not? He's the best player in the playoffs. Jalen Brown is a top 15 player. Mm, I'm just saying, if, if, that, if he's 15, then is Jason 16? I'm just saying, stats over politics. I mean, you keep throwing that first team all NBA around. That was that was two months ago, Toddy. What, what have you done for me lately? You, you mentioned the thirty points in the regular season, and he's like never in twenty in the finals. So, um, yeah, well, Kevin, I just I just have to follow up by saying, of Robert all four Ory. people on this panel, I thought that the guy below me would be the one to throw Robert Ory's name out there. <laughs> Kings fans, we don't speak of that man's name. That is just we were all like. We were all toddlers when that happened, but it's still trauma to Kings fans. Kevin, how dare you mention that man's name? Uh, I'm just saying. Tony Parker not walking around to no trophy. Ah, not walking around to no statue. I'm just saying. Hey, Tony, you know. Tony Parker, Tony Parker won favorite. a finals MVP, though. He, he did win a finals MVP. He though. did win one, but, I mean, as of right now, Jason would have zero. And if they don't ever win again, it'll be zero. But that's, that's a conversation for – Five games, 
when they end up Let losing me. and the Dallas Mavericks end up winning and Luka Doncic gets finals MVP and, you know, we look back at this and laugh and Jason Tatum gets to escape the scrutiny of the summer. So what if they give it to Luka? You said what? What if they give it to Luka? Then that means they would win. This isn't the Jerry West finals where the loser <laughs> takes over the trophy. <laughs> that shit is wrong. like three then. Well, well, yeah, well, I mean, look, LeBron got if, four. If, if, if no, LeBron, I'm saying LeBron would have more because if that was the case. Oh, if that was the case? Oh, yeah. Oh, he so is. LeBron yeah, yeah, yeah. have 30 with a triple but again, double. We're bringing up LeBron, guys. Yeah, we're we're LeBron, up. But, all, but also, like, if LeBron didn't win it in 2015, then no losing player will ever win it again. Like, I know Jerry West was mentioned, but if LeBron didn't win it in 2015, when I think the votes were, like, 5-4, Iguodala and LeBron after LeBron, LeBron was just like 36 lost. in that finals. With no he Kyrie, no, no Kevin Love, no nothing. That was nuts. So, so yeah, with Dova on so all, IV. All, all like implications. Would, yeah, the, the implications would basically just indicate that if you have a Larry Nance. MVP, you likely have their team winning the championship because the, the days of Jerry West are long gone. But, Kevin, we got one other factor, Captain.